Hi folks, is everything okay? In this video, we're going to discuss some bibliometric analysis that are available in Ghost Viewer. This version of, of this video, as you see in English, of course, but we already have a Brazilian Portuguese version of the same video in the channel that took almost 30 minutes. So in this version in English, we're going to split the video into four new videos. The first one discussing the main concepts and a general overview. And the following videos, we're going to detail each one of the analysis. Uh, but first of all, I want to show you where this did come from. And This was the question of a subscriber of our channel, a colleague of us, Lydia. She asked the difference between this analysis. So I already translated her comment. Just let me show here. So she said, Gustavo, first of all, thank you for the content provided. It is helped me, helping me a lot. I did some tests focusing on authors, but I didn't quite understand the difference between the analysis of co-citation cited authors, citation authors, and co-authorship authors. I looked in the Postviewer manual, but it was still not very clear. Could you help me? So that's what we're going to do in this video. We're going to answer the, the, the question of Legion. So. Let's go! So, if you're arriving now on this channel, I'm Dr. Carvalho and welcome to Academia Novar, where we talk about research and innovation. First of all, we have to differentiate two sets of papers. The first one comprise the papers that we selected and downloaded from a database, for instance, Web of Science. So we go to the Web of Science database and we download the file containing all the information about this paper. We represented uh, the set in orange, in this circle, actually an ellipse, and the little circles inside represent these selected papers. The other set that is also important consists of the references cited by these papers. So if we go in the Web of Science and actually in any paper, uh, in the, at the end of it, we have the references, the citations of that paper. So the list of references that and this information is also available in the web of science or any database and we represented those by this other ellipse and the little circles represent all these references so we have these two main sets that we need to differentiate and understand what analysis are available in Vos Viewer for each set? In the first set, the, the papers that we selected and downloaded from the database, we can do these analysis here, the four first analysis in Vos Viewer. We can do a co authorship analysis, a co occurrence, a citation, and a bibliographic couple. So, all these four analyses analyze the, the, first, the first set of papers. That's the information that they're going to analyze. And on the other hand, the co-citation analysis, uh, the, the last one here available in this group of type of analysis in Vos Viewer, the co-citation analysis they, uh, it analyzes this set of papers, the references cited by the other ones that we had downloaded before. So 
this is a first differentiation that we need to understand. The cold citation analysis analyzes just these papers here in the gray area. And in the next videos, we're going to, to show you a hands-on example. I selected three papers of mine in which I am a co-author and we are going to analyze deeply the, the differences between the analysis. The first video we're going to show you the co-authorship analysis, analyzing the authors. In the next video the citation analysis, also by authors. And finally the co-citation anal analysis, considering the cited authors. And we are going to detail the difference between all the analysis. So, see you in the next video.